I'm not here to play around, see I'm only here to mess you up and represent my town Come in here and you'll get rattled, get made fun of like a clown You don't really want to battle, I'm the heaviest of pounds, I ain't lying boy Alright guys, we're here in Alice Springs at the soaring center of Australia, Alice Springs Gliding Club. And uh, I'm not gonna lie to you, I already went on the flight, but I wanna come back in here and make a little promo video. So we're gonna watch how it takes off from the other person and then I'll show you what it's like to take off from being inside it. It's, uh, it's incredible. If you ever come to Alice Springs, the soaring center of Australia. Robert. Robert. He's an awesome, awesome pilot. This, 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 this was epic, I hope you enjoy it. All right, guys, he's out of now. It's about to take off. I just want to show you how this works from out here. This huge little, like, desert area. It's, uh, it's really gnarly. All right, so Rogers. Oh, my God, it's Robert. Robert, you noob. Taking up this cable. So it's going to be pulled along this whole cable. There's a vehicle way up there that pulls the cable. And here it goes, boys. Watch how fast this thing takes off. Watch it. That's crazy how that works. So is there like a button the guy on the rope pushes to disconnect it? Or does a guy in the, the pilot press the button? See how the we, we, we release from the top. There's a, a, a thing we pull. Oh, so as the pilot, you release from it. Yeah. Okay. We can open the hook. Yeah. There you go. He's just hovering. That's so wild, man. <laughs> yeah, it's very efficient. It's a, it's a good thing. And he's off, just like the wedge tail eagle we just saw, boys. That's so sick, it's dude. a little bit of luck, you know, you're high enough to catch a thermal and... Oh, uh, yeah, I see how the thing just drops right now. The clip just came off. Yeah. You can see it dropping. And then the rest of the wire get reeled in. Let's see if I can zoom in on this big time so you guys can see how it looks from out here. So he goes around the circle. So what he's doing, from my understanding, is he's trying to find those... You can feel it when you're in the... Pl in the, in the yeah. You call it a plane? Or, Glider, glider. A glider, yeah, sorry. When you're in the glider, you can feel like the, not just by the sound like Roger was saying when he goes, doo -doo -doo -doo, but you can feel it like it, like it's like a, like how the heat rises, you can feel it pick you up. Oh, yeah. yeah. And so what he's doing right now is he's just going around in circles trying to find, he's just staring to stay within that area, just trying to rise up, right? Yeah. yeah it's wicked how it happens, how it works, man. It's boring to watch. you got to be in it. Yeah. <laughs> just want to kind of show him how it kind of goes from out here. So uh, that gives us a little bit of time to find lift. If you don't find it immediately, we just have to land again. Okay. And then sort of go again, kind of. Okay. Thing, you know? But um, uh, we won't fly too long. They're doing a course. Uh, we're just jumping in, in between what they're doing. Okay. Yeah. But you get a little bit of a, an ID. <laughs> yeah, no, it'll be cool. Yeah. I'm keen to uh, yeah. done some different things. I did, uh, let's see, what have I done so far? They, they opened the reptile park for me. I got to go see Rex, who owns the reptile park. and. Oh. Oh yeah, Rex is a good guy. Yeah, he's awesome. Yeah, and uh, I did the camels. I got to do that. And then uh, yesterday, where I live. I live out there. Oh, you live out with the camels. Okay, yeah. that's like right by the. Is the camels? Is the camels by the telegraph station? Because no. It's okay. Side of town. Ah, so I was wondering. Oh, that's right. Because I so went to the, the camels are like south. Then you got the McDonald Ranges. So it's south yep. of the ranges. Then you got Alice Springs and the telegraph station. Okay. And then we're even further north now. Okay. Yeah, because yeah. yeah, I was at telegraph station doing video there, and then. I forgot they came. There was like an event, and they were letting people have like like oh. kids have camel rides there. And then yesterday I got to do the, I did the hot air balloon oh, yeah. at like okay. sunrise and stuff. That was yeah. pretty gnarly to see it from like that. But so I've seen the landscape. It's pretty much the same. Yeah, yeah. Side, then it's there. You know. Yeah. This is Tenemai Desert, but yeah. Uh, so 
my question is when I go back out, I can't even remember, like I lost signal. <laughs> yes, I just take did, I just yeah. take this road to the main road and take a right and that'll take me back towards Alice Springs. Yeah. Okay, cool. Springs. Don't go left. I don't want to end up in Yeah, yeah, long way. I don't have that much gas. After a few days. Yeah, I only got a quarter tank of fuel, so we should be good. Well I'm gonna grab this uh get my phone here. Again, they just they got the landing back, so um, but that's good for us because then we can sort of jump in it straight away. Also, they're coming to land right now. Oh, that's another car driving. Okay. Basically a big V8 engine with two big drums, one is rope, one of the other wire. Yeah. Uh, about 1500 meters long. Okay. And he just gives full power. I'll talk with him on the radio. Okay. He gives full power, winds in the rope, and that we just get pulled up like a kite. Okay. Yeah. It's a very Sweet. efficient, quick way of getting in the air. Uh, Contra to um, you know being pulled up by a little aeroplane. Yep. That takes us much longer. We don't do it here because it, it will create too much dust. Okay. Oh, so that's what it looks like. Yeah, I've never even seen one of these things. That looks sweet. Oh, really? Yeah. It's about 17 meters span. They're like real aircraft. Okay. So all the same controls, same instruments, same things. We've actually got a bunch of flight computers in there as well for flying distances and things. And that all GPS. Okay. Driven. Um, Let me get my keys out here. A lot to tell about them. Um, you can do great distance in them. Around here, we fly 300 k's, 500 k's easily. 300 k's in one run? Yeah, yeah, yeah. And, oh, and wow. The, the longest I've flown is 850. You flew 850 k's in one trip? Yep. With no engine, no nothing, and just off the. Back where you started. So you just go 400 k's away and come back. Yeah, that's pretty far. It takes so, like, is there a certain technique to where you go, like, to where, like, can you make it go back up? No. Or is it you just. Well, yes. You, so, you, so, you need the sun. To heat up the ground and that heats up the air, so you need you need it rising air. Ah, so it works it better in the, in the heat. In the sunshine, wind doesn't play so much a role, and um, um, you climb up. There's are small pockets of air going up, you know, ter thermals. Yep. And you fly circles in it to stay in there. You rise with it. It's actually tons of air going up. Okay. Um, and then you circle up, and then you fly a distance, and then we, you, of course, but. It's a glider, so you just glide, glide, glide. Yeah. You have to get a next one and the next one. So you're just like, you're, you're gliding until you, if you want to go for a long time, you're gliding until you find another one of these pockets. Yeah, yeah. And then do you, can you like feel it inside yes. the, you can yes. feel the We've pocket? Yes, both instruments for it, but it's a lot of feeling as well. Okay. So, um, and you can see it like on a, on a normal day, you got, got these puffy clouds, cumulus clouds, there's yeah. a lift under those. Because that they get formed by rising air. Ah, okay. You know, air goes up, cools down, condensates, and there you got your clouds. Yep, yep. Yeah. So when you see clouds, we can just go right under them, climb up. Today there's no clouds, and often there's no clouds here. So we have to look at ground features. For instance, the air gets heated up more on the road. Okay. Here. It gets heated up more. There's hangars and you know tin roofs. Like yep. They get heated up, and that makes the air go up. Okay. So we look at that kind of stuff. So you look for you looking for that stuff on the ground to make creates yeah. more heat. But then okay. again, with this wind, it gets broken up very quickly, and it yep. would be hard to catch. So. Um, we probably won't be long up either. That's okay. We'll see, we'll see That's okay. We, yeah. uh, we can we can go if you're ready to go. Yeah, I'm. I'm I mean, I'm ready. Uh, yeah. Let me just uh, see. So I was thinking about when I sit in there. Is it, when I sit, can we try to kind of set my backpack on my lap? We'll go have a look. We'll see we'll how it works. So I, can, I can adjust the back seat and stuff like that. So okay. Just go and have a look. I mean, we're not in a in a hurry. I just don't want to take too much of that at all. Okay. Uh, Ian, I'll, I'll get in Ian. Uh, I'll, I'll go now. Know how long you've been, that's it. Huh? Know how long you've been. Yeah, yeah, no, I'll we'll launch it. There's some pretty heavy sinker out of it. Should be able to find something. Well, you didn't find anything. Alright guys, so this is the, uh, this is what we're going up in, boys. This is Roger, our pilot. He's going to take us up on one of these bad boys. This is the uh, ASK-21. Man, look at how big the wings are, man. This thing's huge. Super gnarly. It 
it's a, uh, a trainer glider. This is where we train, train our pilots in. Okay. So the instructor sits in the back. Yep. And the, uh, the student in the front. Okay. So you're going you're gonna to be in the front today. Okay. We're going from this side. Okay. Like I said, 717 meter span, and you and I in it all together be about 600 kilos. Okay. All right. Now, what you need to do is I'll show you first how to get in. Okay. Uh, these are not made for comfort; they're made for for fun. Yep. <laughs> so I'll push it down because it's, it goes down on the nose like that. And you, oh, sorry. I don't mind if you put your shoes on there. Okay. But you you got to sort of lower yourself. Down. Lower yourself in like okay. this. Okay. You know? Okay. I'll hold your pack for now, yeah. or whatever. That's right. Yeah, that's right. Hold that as well. Oh, I can okay. Put it down. Okay. Oh yeah. Okay. I already see. Just get out again. I'm gonna take. I'm gonna take your seat back out and give you more space. Okay. You're a tall guy. Yeah, I'm a tall guy. I'm going to do is take this thing out. Remove it completely. You still have a nice cushion in the back, but that will give you way more space. Okay. So, awesome. take, take two. Just a push down. Yeah. Oh, much better, eh? Yeah, much better. So, go, go a little bit forward. So, are, you, are you you comfortable? You yeah, okay? I'm comfortable. That's it? Yeah. yeah, this is good, brother. Uh, you're going to hit your head on the canopy. I think you need to slide a little bit down. That no, you'll be good. Yep. That's good. Okay. A little space for your feet, your legs. Yep. There yeah, as well. Okay, now see if you can maneuver your pack down. Let's hold this in here like this. I don't need to touch none of this stuff right down no, here, right? The only thing that you really need to watch out for, uh, this stick is going to move. And okay. like when we go up, it goes all the way back. Just like make sure that. I don't touch that thing then, right? Yeah. Okay. But don't slide you. I'll feel it if the pack would slide down. No, no, I'll make sure. I'll try to hold on to it. Oh, I thought you put my seatbelt on, right? Yeah, yeah, we'll do that in a sec. Oh, okay. you, if you're all good to go like this. This is what it looks like, guys. This is a... Uh, we're riding. This is awesome, yeah. All right, well, let's just trap you in then. Um, okay. We'll grab these belts here. Too many beers in Thailand, mate. Let's That's good. <laughs> and you had a beer yesterday. We just saw that actually. Oh yeah. I saw you live in the. Oh yeah. At the brewery. Yeah, I did the six wing challenge, mate. And uh, oh god, it was. Uh, I only saw it when you sort of walked in. Uh, oh yeah, I, they have these wings there, right? And I, uh, I did the wing challenge, and uh, so they call them scallions or whatever like so jalapenos 6,000 oh, okay. I added this sauce that was 1 million so it was 2,000 times hotter than a jalapeno oh god yeah. it was the worst experience like I've ever had in my life yeah, I would yeah, never yeah. recommend I like hot but that's probably yeah you know. it was pretty hot alright so again we need to strap this two together first you want okay. me just to do it for you is that okay yeah, yeah. I'll just get this one right back up this away. one goes in there there so and I will no, you're sitting pretty good actually. This is pretty good. And this one. Okay. So you can't get out there. Yep. These ones don't have to be too tight, they can just sit All right. just like that. And like this. Okay. How's that? Perfect man. Yeah. Comfortable and everything. Right. So I won't tell you much about the instruments. I've got all the same in the back. It's all double up. Double okay, controls, so you got the same instruments that are got everything in the back. There's a beeping thing, this one. Yep. You can turn that up. That gives an indication if you're going up or down. So one three in a thermal, I use that okay. because then I don't have to look at the instruments. I can just listen. Okay, so cool, it goes, cool. Beep, 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 go up and it goes. Up, That's what we're going, going down. down. Uh, because you're not always feeling it. Yep. There's altimeter, speed, everything. Same as in a power plane with a radio here. Two flight computers. Uh, okay. But I'll tell you how fast we go and, and how high we are. Okay, okay. awesome. My question is, uh, is there, there's nothing my feet can hit while they're down here, right? No, I've got pedals at the front. You just let leave your feet, they, 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 you, you, you're on it, you can just feel with me, or have your feet there, that's fine. Okay. Yeah. You feel them okay. probably move, and that's me. Okay, them. okay. Um, when we land, this yep. will come out, and you will sort of hear noises like that. Those yep. are the airplanes, and 
the ring. Okay. If you look at the ring, they come out like that. Oh, okay. Okay. That controls our descent. Like, okay, right? awesome, awesome, yeah. okay. So you can fly them very precise, like I can put a line on the ground here and stop right there if I want to. Oh, wow, so, okay. Oh, yeah, you can really... All right. It's the only thing, there's no engine. We can't it's go sweet as, yeah. Is, yeah, this is cool. <laughs> so you hear a bit of... I'm really excited like that. for this. Don't stick your finger in there. Yep. Um, I'll show you quickly when this is closed. Okay. So this little window here, you can pull it towards it and open it like that. Makes a bit of wind noise. You can even stick your hand or a selfie stick out if you like. Okay. Um, when we go up, we'll have it like this. Just have the little one open. Yep. That gives you continuously a bit of air. Okay. And we can talk a bit better. Okay. I'll probably just leave it closed so I can communicate with you. Cause yeah, like... but if you want to film outside, that's probably better too. Okay. So how does we see how that works? You need us. So you just pull this. Oh, like that. Okay. Yeah. You pull this one back. This back, one back. And then, okay. Yeah. And this one goes. Leave that open like that. Okay. Okay. Cool. Awesome. Uh, all right. One more safety thing. So we'll go pretty steep, as you saw. So it's like you know, all out, all out, and you just give full power, and we go up pretty steep. Yep. If anything would happen at that stage, I'll have to put the nose down, and we land straight ahead again, or we okay. do a short circuit, or whatever needs to be done. Okay. Um, but you might have a bit of a, a feeling like that, you know, okay. because we're going like this and yeah. we'll have to go like that to land, you know. Okay. But we probably go just up like that. It hardly happens. Alright. Well, you think you're ready? I'm ready, boys. Let's do All this. Right. Okay. Getting a little bit hot. I'm scared. Before we go, that locks that one plus the other one. Can you do that? Like, uh, like that? There we go. Locked in. I'll go in the back. All right, brother. We'll do a few checks. So same thing. I'll strap myself in as well. Okay. I'll do a few pre-takeoff checks. All right, boys. This is gonna be exciting. It's like we're in a little. Uh, like I'm in like a military plane. I'm about to go drop some some bombs on somebody or something. It's awesome. Is this what like uh is this what like uh like fighter pilots feel like when they're in like a yeah, it's tube like this? Yeah. Let's okay. Yeah. Oh, I'll make some radio calls as well, so if you suddenly hear me talk, uh, okay. you can speak. That's just. We're flying in a controlled airspace, so... Okay. No worries, man. Bomb Springs traffic, uh, glider, Mike November, range launching, runway 1-2, Bomb Springs. All right. Yep. Have you taken the seat out? Yes. Have it. Open. Closed. Closed. All right. Is he called ready yet? Huh? Is he called ready? Yeah. All right, let's just get the cable from the left there. This is such an awesome, it's, um, this is such a unique view. Like. Oh, it's the best place, it's of course in the front, you know, so. Yeah. yeah. It's a bit hot, don't worry, once we're up in the yeah. air and we get a bit of wind flowing, it's uh, definitely warm in here, boys. Yeah. But it's, it's going to be worth it. I'm excited for this. This is going to be awesome. Roger's, yeah. Roger's going to take good care of us. It's going to be it's going to be lit. Close and lock. Close and lock. Yeah. So we get pulled by a vehicle. Well, it's stationary. It, it's yeah. a big V8 and he just winds the drum. Okay. Once the cable in. Okay. Okay. Grinch, Mike November, take up slack, take up slack, take up slack. That's the winch driver talking to us. So he's taking up slack on that cable now. So he's way up there. Yep. There we go. Oh. All out, all out. Oh, yes, boys. Oh my god, we are fucking going fast. Okay, we're about 100 k's an hour now. 100 k's an hour right now? Yeah. Oh. <laughs> it's a pretty efficient.
official way of going up, isn't it? Wow, that's insane. I cannot believe that this happened. You know, 100k is an hour. 3,000 feet. My ears are popping like... My ears are popping like crazy. Look at that view, mates. Climbing up. Still climbing. Oh. There we are. Now we're gliding. We're gliding. Now the spring's on the nose there. And I think we just flew to some lift. So we're just going to turn. Okay. okay. Yep, we're doing good. Yeah. Wow, look at that view, man. Holy cow. Okay, of my days have been up really high, we're sort of uh, like 3,800 feet, so 12, 1,300 feet. So we'll have to find some more quickly. Oh, oh, I can feel it, we're lifting up, we're yep, lifting up. Yep, yep, yep. There's like these air pockets that pick us up. That's it. I can feel it. <laughs> oh, wow, that's awesome. Oh my God, that's so cool. Oh my! Lean with the glider. Lean with the glider. It's a bit close to the ground, so the air pocket is small, so it's going to turn a little bit steep. A little bit steep. And if you're happy with it, we're I'm very happy. happy. We're good, man. This is awesome. We're going up about two to three knots, so two hundred three hundred feet a minute. Two hundred three hundred feet a minute. We're going up. Yeah. Uh, four or five knots now. Four or five. Wow, we're flying up. Oh man, this is so cool. Holy cow! Yeah. It's solar powered. We're 600, 600 kilos get lifted up like we're in an elevator. Wow. So you don't really see it, but we're going up. You can feel it. Too, I can right? feel it. Oh, yeah, I can feel it. Oh, yeah, I can feel it. Oh, wow. Look at that view, mate. This is unreal. Oh, my God. Oh, the Stuart Highway going straight to Darwin. Yeah. Still <laughs> so goes up to Darwin. Nice ranges over there. Sitting in my desert all the way to Western Australia. That's Woo! like that. Just nothing. That's a straight desert. <laughs> oh my god, this is so awesome, dude. <laughs> and there you see the McDonald Ranges. There's the McDonald Ranges right there, guys. Yeah. The cat and of course Alice. Oh, god. oh man. <laughs> and isn't it nice? Just a bit of It's just so crazy, just yeah. when it's so peaceful, dude. Floating around here, yes, it is. That's just. I can't even. Exp this is so awesome, guys. It's not as quiet as in a balloon, of course. Yeah, no, but it's. This is like feeling that, feeling that, uh, that force. Like, yeah. When we lift off, that was. Oh, just that yeah. was crazy. Yeah. Yeah. Well, it's tons and tons of air going out. That's not yeah. really a power of nature. It's, uh, it's huge. Yeah. It's just straight solar power, guys, picking us up. Heat pockets are picking us up right now. This is awesome. Oh, oh my God, bro. <laughs> four thousand feet, guys. Yep, we're going up. Well, four thousand two hundred already. Four thousand two hundred. Oh man! Oh man! Just have to search a little bit for where it is. But, uh, Just trying to find another heat pocket, I think. This is so gnarly, dude. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh. Once wow. we get to 5,000 feet, we can actually see over the McDowell Ranges and you can see Pine Gap, that military installation. Yeah, okay, so see guys, we're hitting these heat, we're hitting these heat pockets and that's how we're rising, we're at 4,600 feet right now. Yeah. So we're gonna go up to 5,000 feet. Which is insane. We're using heat from the sun off the earth to go there's up. There's an eagle on your left, down there. Oh, oh yeah, there's an eagle for it. Right, we're above it. Yeah, I can see the eagle. Yo, that's what it's like to be an eagle. That's a red tail eagle. Oh, those smaller. are huge. Oh, they, yeah, that's a smaller one though. They get pretty big, don't they? They fly in the same pockets as us. 
Okay. They are the best finders of lift. If you see one, we go to them. Okay, so we try to fly where they fly. Did you see him? Yeah, I can see him. Yeah. I see him. 4,900 feet, guys. We're still going up. That's so sick. No engine. Just science, baby. <laughs> there is Pine Gap over the ridges there, right there. Oh, right? yeah. Pine Gap yeah. way out in the ridges right there. Yep. Oh, wow, Roger. This is so cool, man. We just hit 5,000 feet, guys. No engine. <laughs> wow. It was quickly done, wasn't it? Yeah, dude. That was so sick. You're the man, bro. Oh, this is unreal. Alright, well like I said, there's a real airplane. You can do anything you like with them. Yep. You can even do aerobatics. Yeah, aerobatics? Would you be interested? Yeah, I'm down. You can do a loop? We're gonna do a loop? Yep. I'm down to do a loop, let's go. Okay, well. <laughs> we make sure that the airspace is free for all the aircraft. Not busy here in the airspace. I'm ready, let's do it. So that's the time to get some speed. Oh god! Oh my god, that's crazy! Oh my god, bro! Holy shit! Oh, no fucking way! Oh god, that was awesome! Oh, oh, oh shit! Oh my god, dude! No way! That's so crazy! Oh, yes! Yes! Oh god, dude! That's so sick! Oh my god, bro! Oh, that feeling is insane! Yeah. Oh, bro, that's so gnarly. Oh, 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 God. Oh. <laughs> You're very quick, quickly lose a lot of height. Oh, <laughs> yeah. Mate, oh, my God. Oh, my yeah, God, yeah. that was so cool, bro. <laughs> oh. And there's another thermal here. Another thermal, let's go. Yes. Oh, he just did a backflip, dude. That's so sick. <laughs> oh, man, Roger. Like, I don't know how you learned how to do that, bro, but... <laughs> that's my whole life. Oh, that's so sick, yep. man. I learned it when I was 13. Flew oh. solo when I was 14. That's flew right. solo when you were 14? Yes. They're <laughs> 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 great toys. Yeah, <laughs> definitely. Wow, that was so cool, man. So you got a little bit of an idea how it all works. Yeah. What we really do for the sport of soaring is, of course, we climb up. Yep. And then we fly big distances. That's what we want to oh, do. Oh, so you want to go up and then... Like we have 30 gliders in the air. Yep. And we fly 300 times and we'll, we'll see who can do that quickest. Okay, that's awesome. The lift guys are with us today. We're lifting back up to 5,000 feet almost, guys. Yo, that's so cool, dude. There's a big jet coming in there. Oh, oh yeah, big jet. Yeah, big jet. So they're flying on that side of the motorway. Yep. We're staying on this side because we're flying in the same airspace. It's going into Alice. Okay. You see there? Yep. There you go. Oh. Oh, yeah. Yo, look at that, dude. There's the jet. You see him? The jet right there? Yep. Oh. <laughs> oh. All right. Thanks for sailing down. That's the only guy ever fly. Okay. Sounds good, brother. Yo, we got to get some ones in the chat for Roger, man. This guy is a legend. Oh, man, that's so cool. Yeah, man, it's 
uh, that's just so cool, bro. It's so cool, dude. Hey, so I'm recording all of this so it'll be in super high quality. This will be on the internet, dude. We gotta, we gotta show the world this place, bro. It's so sick. Oh. Cool. I like it, you like it. Yeah. No, bro. Oh, man, I love it, dude. It's, just, it's not something I get to do every day, man, so. Just look at all the colors, guys. The different colors, y'all. Red, that spot is. Yeah, like I said, we can go flying for five, six hours for that. Go flying for, he said, five or six hours. No engines using the heat pockets. There's not even a cell phone tower out here, guys. Uh, I think we got a little bit of recession, but I'm gonna show you this. I got this recorded in HD. Yep, so we're all the way down to. Okay, I can feel it drop, like a little drop. Oh, yeah. So cool to see all the roads, how they're just dirt red. Okay. Okay. Coming in half of the landing, boys. We did it, boys. We did it. Yes. Oh, we're so hot, man. Oh, yeah. When you step out, it will come up. Yeah, keep the weight up here on this. Keep it down. Yeah, and just slowly like come up. There it is. Oh. Oh, right. there you go. Bro, guys. When you guys see this, when, we, when I show this back on the internet, I expect a million ones for this man Roger right here, dude. That was one of the wildest rides I've ever been on in my life. That was, dude, that was just, dude, that was magical, bro. Pleasure. Like, that was awesome. <laughs> Here to play around, see I'm only here to mess you up and represent my town Come in here and you'll get rattled, get made fun of like a clown You don't really want to battle, I'm the heaviest of pounds, I ain't lying boy